She's a very funny lady. Give it up for Alice Wetterland. Thank you. What's up, New York Comedy Club? Hey. You know any birthdays in the audience tonight? It's really didn't expect there to be any, so that's okay. Uh, my, uh, my roommate just turned 27, and I was like, uh, be careful not to kill yourself with drugs. <laughs> um, he was like, that's the age that a lot of notables uh, chose to off themselves. And like Kurt Cobain, Jimi Hendrix, Lady Gaga, fingers crossed. <laughs> I, uh, I work part time so that I can pursue uh, my dream of spending one million dollars on improv classes. Uh, seems like that's the goal at the moment. Uh, but I work in I work in a boutique, and uh, I got in a, a situation with a, a client the other day. I pissed this woman off real bad, and uh, it was disorienting for me because she had this like really cartoonish, jovial, super thick Scottish accent. Uh, I'll say this. It was a little hard to take her seriously. Uh, seemed like she wanted to make friends. She was like a Bella Sebastian song. Uh, so she stormed out. And she was like, she was like, you just lost the customer. But like part of me was waiting for her to come back and be like, but you gained a friend. <laughs> no dice. So, uh, so I've, been, uh, I've been dating. I'm sure other people have done in their lives, and uh, I love, it's fun, but um, I'm not so good at, I'm not so good at it, uh, because you have to play it cool, you know, you can't, uh, when you like somebody, you gotta leave them alone a little bit, uh, I'm not so good at that part, and uh, that's strange, because that's what works super well on me, um, I've had a lot of guys ignore their way into my heart for years. <laughs> body spray, like coming up with all these new, fancy, more sophisticated fragrances. All I really smell is a guy who's trying. And it's not working for me. Like, I think it would be amazing, bear with me, if they could come up with a scent that made you smell like you're not even in the room. <laughs> right? You're like, wow, hey, you look great. And you smell like you're standing me up. <laughs> I want a piece of it now. <laughs> to me, you know. I thought about this. They could call it absent. Right? <laughs> it's good. I'm gonna mail it to myself. Look for it in stores in the aisle of impossible inventions. Um, I had a guy hit on me the other day, uh, like in full Ed Hardy gear. And I was like checking myself, like, oh my god, did somebody put a sign on my back with a dragon that wants revenge? <laughs> message of Ed Hardy is, um, yo, I'm super tough, I got a tattoo, and it didn't even hurt at all, because I got it on my shirt, <laughs> I told him I had a boyfriend, uh, which is not true, uh, I just broke up with my boyfriend actually, but, um, yeah, it's fine. Uh, but I like, I miss that, having that like pocket, super handy, polite way of turning down potential suitors. So much nicer than the truth, which is often that they are disgusting. Uh, sometimes it's true. Um, and I still say it, even though it's not true, because there are some people for whom that is the only valid excuse for turning them down. Like, it's like a dip system. Are you taken? No, you're not? Well, uh, okay, then we're definitely dating immediately. Like, I had this guy that I knew who, I swear to God, every time he saw me when I had a boyfriend, he'd be like, still got a boyfriend? Too bad. And so, that was the only thing keeping us apart. And I'd be like, no, Johnny, it's not just that. We're from two different worlds. I'm from planet Earth, and you're from the planet where I'm remotely in your league. That's right, he was out of my league. You think I want to get burned? No. I know what I'm doing. I'm not stupid. <laughs> what do I do with this? I, I, uh, I do miss my boyfriend. It didn't work out. And um, I think I was a good girlfriend. You know, I was never jealous. 
You know, like if they went to a strip club or something, they wouldn't freak out. I'm not one of those girls, you know. I mean, I put it this way. There's not a lot of strippers out there that can hold a candle to my not being a stripper. Right? <laughs>